So the major opportunities that we have is you can do a customized approach. That is what the customer is looking for today. Customized, catered, one-to-one -one approach <clears throat> or community or group or mastermind type of approach. This leads to market disruption. Okay. You can disrupt the marketplace, create your own blue ocean and have no competition. And on top of that, living in a time where you can collaborate never before, right? You go back two, four years or so, you reach out to someone that has a hundred thousand subs, a million subs, and you would hear crickets, right? Well, nowadays, I mean, this is from personal experience. It might be different, varies for others, but I'm willing to bet in the right situations, in the right environments, in the right ecosystems, when you reach out genuinely searching for collaboration, mutual beneficial opportunities or relationships, these people respond. I mean, I've reached out to people with more followers than me, more subscribers. I show them what I'm doing, provide that full, honest, open transparency, and I've actually had people respond and then vice versa. I've had people with much lower subscribers, much lower um, followings or no following whatsoever. And people reach out wanting to do some work together, create a mutual beneficial relationship, collaboration, partnership, a, a profitable experience. And I'm entertaining the conversation. I'm reaching back out. I'm saying, hello, I'm here. I'm open. I'm willing to hear what you got to say, right? It's because I, I personally just believe that a lot of businesses have bought into the philosophy of collaboration over competition. I think people are realizing that there's so much money in the marketplace today. There's so much opportunity in the marketplace today that very few people are even going after it. So it's just like there's a huge gap, right? So and then the other opportunity is really around sales and marketing where you're able to amp up your sales and marketing by creating content, by getting into the marketplace. And, and I can't wait to share these numbers on the left here. I'm going to make sense of this in a few minutes. It's just it blew me away. I think it'll blow you away. Before we get into that, I want to talk about the strategy in terms of what these successful financial influencers are doing, following in their footsteps, just looking at what works, doing your own market research. And here's what I have found. And here has here is what I have done that has led to a seven figure revenue. Right over the last four years, I'm able to generate over seven figures, approaching second million. Right, so I've already made over a million, and in just four years, approaching five years, I'm now approaching my second million. That's crazy for a 26 year old Puerto Rican kid, grew up with single mom, and never making more than 30 grand a year for the majority of my life, and the people around me not making more than 30, 40, 50, 60 k a year. That's insane. That's insane. That is no small task. Right. And the other thing that I love is that you, it's huge to me. It might be small as someone else, but it's huge to me. Huge, huge. Nearly make two million dollars. Twenty six years old, almost at two million total rev since 2018. That's a major accomplishment in my books, in, in my head. Right. And what I love is you, you don't have to compare to what other people are doing. You simply get to view. You simply now get to think bigger. I was listening to a podcast. It was Ryan Pineda, Grant Cardone. They were talking back and forth. And somewhere in the conversation, uh, Grant asked Pineda, he was like, how much are you making per day? You know, Stripe just hits your account, you know, through your funnels, through your systems. And he said 50K to a, to 100 a day. And I that just like, I was just like, oh my goodness, 50 grand to 100K a day. This guy is making extreme impact. Guys, that's over $18 million a year. You just do 50K times 365. It's over 18 million a year. I've only done two. I've only done under two in four years. Can you imagine if I just kept doing what I'm doing and get around people like them to learn the different strategies? And guess what? You you don't even have to pay to, to, to learn what they're doing. They're putting it out there. They're giving books away, guys. They're giving workshops away. They're, they're just creating the content and they're showing you the entire blueprint and i'm just looking at it like oh all right mm, yep mm, that's one strategy mm, i'm gonna do that yeah mm-hmm 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 gets me excited so here, here are the strategies that they do that i've seen it's one-to-one -one initially when you first start out especially in the in the finance space it's one-to-one -one, right you're creating content you're marketing you then convert you sell one person then you talk to that person one-to-one and then you're providing them with other products and services down the line to increase 
the long-term value of that client. So one-to-one, that's still working, trading dollars per hour, right? Then there's group. I like group. It's now you're forming a community from all those one-to-one clients. You then bring them all together in a group setting and you have a mastermind or you have an in-person event or a virtual workshop or a hybrid, right? More people than ever before are more open to the virtual workshop. So it costs less to do it on your end instead of hosting an in-person mastermind that might cost you thousands. Then you got the courses. Courses are not subject to your time, so it's evergreen, right? And now you're buying more of your time back through courses, books, affiliates, and sponsors, right? All of this is not subject to you actually putting in the work. It's just you doing the work one time, setting up an automation system to handle it, monetize it, and then you keep keep rinsing and repeating, the number keeps growing. These are the different strategies that I've seen in this space, particularly because I'm talking to those who are looking to build a career in the finance space. Here is some of the major opportunities in the 21st century to do that, right? Now, let's go on to this side. This, probably my most favorite part right here. This is my own market research via Google, via Forbes, via different um, credible news outlets like Amplify and Creator Economy and what was the other one? Uh, ExplodingTopics.com, right? All these different sites that you can check out for yourself. So I, I put all the different stats together to give me a range of what I'm working with. Right, there, this might be off, but it, this is giving you a, a really good analysis of what the marketplace looks like today. There are 50 million, according to Forbes, according to another article I saw, there's 200 million content creators globally, worldwide, anywhere from as low as 50 to 200 million. Forbes said it was 50 million. I'm going to go with that higher number, 200 million. I think that's probably more real, realistic. But then of that 200 million, there's probably so many that are inactive, not making any money, et cetera, et cetera. So <clears throat> I try to narrow the search even more to try and get real, real accurate stuff here. Of that 50 to 200 million, another site on, on Google, when I did my research, it said there's 139 million content creators. This is every type of content creator, not just the finance space. This is every single type of content creator, right? Only fans. I mean, everything in here, everything. There's 139 million content creators with 1,000 to 10,000 followers, right? So do 200 minus 139, they're all under 1,000 followers, right? Bunch of people that are not being seen, right? That might be you, okay? Then of that 139 million, that have anywhere from one to 10,000 followers, there's only 2 million, 1% off 200 million, 4% off 50 million. Only one to 4% of content creators globally have 100 to 1 million followers. I am not in that category, right? I am in between the 139 and the 2 mil, right? I'm at 46,000 subscribers as I record this, making six figures, multiple six figures each and every year. So followers has nothing to do with income. That's a totally different conversation. But this is just showing you what work has been done by content creators based off the following. So 2 million, 100K to 1 million followers. Then I try to do even more now research. I say, okay, of the amount of content creators globally, right? Which ones are financial influencers, right? And financial influencers is the general word that I've seen the articles in, in Google try to batch all of these careers into, right? Anyone that talks, anyone that remotely talks about finance was thrown in these numbers below, right? So looking at just YouTube and Instagram, they did a study on roughly 4.2 million people, right? A little over 4.2 million people was the study. And of that 4.2 plus million, 68,977 are financial influencers. Meaning when you go on their profile, that's their main thing, right? And on YouTube, it's 37,907. Guys, you add up, like if you did, you added these numbers up, times it by one to 4%, there is only worldwide, there's only 1,068 to as high as 4,275 financial influencers with 100,000 to 1 million or more followers. That's it. 
that is it. So I looked at that. From there, all I have to do is market research the specific service that I'm going to provide. So I want to talk to financial coaches and consultants because this is an area that I've personally have been mastering, practicing, and have a lot of experience in working with over a thousand plus people and helping thousands of people, tens of thousands of people, arguably, arguably, right? And I've been able to create a little program, a little community around it. So that's who I'm going to talk to for a minute here and say, of these numbers, of the thousand to four thousand financial influencers that are that have serious followings, all you have to do now is market research who is a financial coach or a financial consultant or financial strategist, go down the list, that has a hundred thousand to one million followers. And then just observe them, see what they're doing, right? See what they're doing, and then you recreate the content that you want to create but by using some of the strategies that they used you pay attention to the titles on their channel you pay attention to the thumbnails you pay attention to how they put the descriptions right the links the ads the intro the outros the the different marketing tactics just observe 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 not for too long don't get in procrastination we only need to observe maybe three to five influencers and you can create your strategy completely for free just following what they're doing and then if you're real smart as you're selecting the people that you're like you know what this person is an exact example of who i want to be right of how i want to serve people and how i want to present myself on the internet okay you know what the next smartest thing to do is get in their ecosystem start liking their content subscribe follow share comment join their newsletter, subscribe to any free workshops, any free content, any free ebook or whatever that they're offering. Get all of it and now you're you're viewing them as a customer but also as a creator where you're going to literally do what they do, right? And then as you do that, trust me when I tell you, even these creators with 100,000, 500,000 million followers or more, they pay attention to who is actually for them, who is actually a super fan. They pay attention and they honor those people. So then what you what you do, right? When you start creating content, building out your strategy, what's the next best thing that you can do? Give. How? Give glory. When you create content, you can then point to that person that you've been watching and saying, this person helped me, mm, 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 dot, 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 right? Tag them in the video, even if they never see it. Tag them, comment them, give them glory, give them grace, give them, you know, boost them up, give them their flowers. Okay. You consistently do that as you're creating content, creating your market. Guess who you start to attract? Their followers. Not every one of their followers is their clients. So now those followers see you in the suggested videos, and then what? They hit you up and they're like, oh, you're, you know, not as expensive as that guru or you're more affordable, or you relate to me more, all this different stuff. Guys, there's your strategy right there. Before you know it, you got clients in the door. Before you know it, you might land yourself a collaboration. You know why? Because nobody else is doing it, literally, like nobody. So what I do is I will give glory to someone that I I like, right? I'll tag them in my stuff. I'll let them know I'm going to their event and I'll just keep doing it. Even if I never get noticed, it's not a big deal. I just keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it. One day before you know it, when I'm 31 years old, I get invited to speak on their platform, right? Collaborate with them. and But they get to see when that actually goes down, they now do their research. Their team lets them know, hey, Denzel's going to be speaking. They do a little research and they're like, boom, boom, boom boom, this guy has been promoting my work for the last five, six, seven years. Holy crap. This guy's a super fan. He's serious. He knows my work. Now they're like, I need to check this guy out. And then that's when you have your personal explosion based on someone else's success. That's another major opportunity in going all in and creating content is by someone else's success, you could jump in no time, in no time. I've personally witnessed this personally seeing this for myself where I had a nice little jump 
right? So this is all fantastic uh, uh, strategies, information I want to, you know, share with you. If you have any more questions, you want to work with me one-to-one, -one, send me a message, right? 